All right, here's a look inside before I button it up. So I have the humbucking pickup and the wires are neatly routed and hot glued to the potentiometer. There's also a ground wire that is connected from the potentiometer that's going to attach to the bridge. And then the output of the potentiometer to the input jack. And you can also notice that underneath the neck here are the mounting blocks. These are glued to the box. And their height has been precision measured so that it's exactly the right height for a flush mount at the top here. And you can see the lip here has been cut out to allow a nice tight fit. One thing I always do before I button it up is to test it out. Make sure the pickup works. Alright, we're good. Alright, feast your eyes on this beauty. This is a tobacco box that has been sanded and stained. I do have a humbucker. I do have an input jack and a volume knob. And check out those sexy looking F holes. The uh, fretboard on this one here is one of those thick ones. This one here is a half, is a, yeah, half inch. The fretboard is a half inch thick. And so that's been glued to this other piece that's a um, one inch and then another half inch on the bottom. So this is a beefy, beefy, beefy neck. And I do have the uh, golden screws for the inlays and then screws on top for the inlays as well. And the headstock, traditional. But the tone of this thing... <laughs> some reverb. All right, let's try some some gain. This thing has got an awesome, awesome sound. <clears throat> Let's try something here.
So there you have it, folks. Another beautiful three-string cigar box guitar. This one here, a tobacco box. And that's it. Talk to you guys later.